It is time for Dodgers baseball finally. How about that? Yeah. Spring training has become summer camp, Jeff. CBS 2 Sports Director Jim Hill is live from Dodger Stadium, where there is excitement, but also some tough news from the league. Nice to see you out there mm -hmm. at the ballpark, Jim. Pat, thank you very much. Nice to be out at the ballpark and all the fresh air. That is for sure, because I'm live at Dodger Stadium. But once again, coronavirus is having a very a very big impact on the world of sports. Here is the latest for you right here on CBS 2. Major League Baseball and the Players Association released the results of the first round of the COVID-19 testing. There were 38 positive tests for more than 3,185 total samples for positivity rate of about 1.2%. 31 of the positive tests were players with the other seven staff members and 19 teams experiencing at least one positive test. Some teams have not completed their testing. Meanwhile, the Dodgers began preparation for the upcoming 60-game season today. The Blue Crew holding their very first workout of the summer camp with the season scheduled to start in about three weeks. Everyone has had to adjust to the new norm during the pandemic, including Dodger players and coaches. My normal today is I get to coach baseball. I get to be around people in a, in a responsible way. I get to you know, be back at Dodger Stadium, albeit uh, spring training 2.0. So that's some semblance of normal. Um, and I think the more players we get out here, and I think each day I'm hopeful that we get better at this. The routine aspect of it has been hard for everybody. You know, baseball players are creatures of habit by nature. And, um, you know, it's been really good, I think, accountability for everybody across the league to stay up, you know, wherever they were and try to be ready for the season. And, um, it was a good test, you know, I think for everybody to try and be as ready as possible for the year. And we'll have more on the Dodgers and Angels coming up at 6 o'clock. Pat and Jeff, back to you in the studio now.